But first, some breaking news as we learn one of the victims of the deadly helicopter crash in New York was a Dallas firefighter. Thanks for joining us. I'm Russ McCaskey. And I'm Gilma Avalos in for Karen Borda. Jason Allen is working to gather details on this breaking news story and joins us live in the studio. Jason? Yeah, Ed Gilma, that helicopter crashed into New York City's East River Sunday night, and we have confirmed here in just the last hour that Brian McDaniel, who is a Dallas firefighter, was one of the five passengers killed in that crash. We just got that picture of him there a few minutes ago. We also have video that you saw there that was taken from a cell phone that shows the helicopter hitting the water on the city's east side. And this was last evening. The, the pilot was the only one who survived that crash. And the pilot had called for help over the radio just before that helicopter went down. This was a sightseeing helicopter. It was chartered for a photo shoot, and the passengers were all wearing very tight harnesses to keep them in. They could not get out as that chopper went down in the 40 degree water. The National Transportation Safety Board is investigating. We are working on getting more information from Dallas Fire Rescue about that firefighter who was on board, and other local media also reporting that there was a second victim, also from Dallas, on board that helicopter.